of Vlogged Hobo, I am here to show you how I like to make sweet and sour chicken. I have the rice over here, I don't know if you can see me very well, over here cooking already. Then I already um, pre-got the chicken ready because it was a two-handed job. I um, floured it and I put an egg, egg and milk wash and seasoned it with seasoning salt and pepper. And here it is. Um, Freddy's on the count of, um, being bad. Um, so yeah, I like to see, I seasoned it up a little bit with seasoning salt, and I put pepper in it. So this is a big pile of chicken. And I'm going to take it over to the skillet. There's the rice. And here is the, my skillet. Um, they only get my tongs, and I'm just going to nice and hot. Freddy, get down, please. He loves to be a brat, and I'm just going to put the chicken in here and we'll let it cook. All the way, and this is like the first half of this video. Um, so yeah, my mom, Mrs. The recipe my mom used to make all the time. I had it several times growing up. Um, she taught me it. She taught me quite a bit of about cooking and all that stuff. So. I love sweet and sour chicken made my way. I mean, I'm just like, maybe you want to, I can't, I cannot talk. Maybe you want to try it my way, I'll keep it the way you do it. Uh, if you never made sweet and sour chicken, maybe this is an idea for you. Um, so yeah. Okay. So I just have this in the skillet, and I'm going to let this cook. All the way, then I will like come back and show you how how it looks when it's done, how the chicken looks when it's done, and I will get started on the vegetables and the pineapple and then the sauce. All right, we'll see you in a few, see you in a few minutes. Bye. Lady, I'm back. While the chicken cooks, I'm going to show you how I do the sauce for the um, sweet and sour chicken. This is going to be really fast because i got to turn the chicken. Um, and here I have a third cup of brown sugar, a whole jar of the sweet and sour sauce. And what I did was I pulled the pineapple juice in here and shook it, shook, can talk, shook it around to get all the excess um, sauce out of it. Then I put the pineapple juice in here and I just mix it. up in here. I'm probably have to let you guys go. I just mix it up really good in this because all mixed up. Then once the vegetables are done, I pull this over the vegetables and then I let it cook a little bit longer. The rice gets done. Then I will show you the rest. So yes. Alright. See you in a little bit. Bye. Everybody, the chicken is done. I'm gonna put this in the microwave after I show you what I do with the vegetables. Over here, I got the pineapple cut up a little bit more. Um, that's gonna go in with probably around the same size of the sauce. What I do with my onions and red onions and green pepper is I just cleaned out the skillet with um, grease and put some nice olive oil in it. And just going to just hold on. Put these outside barking. Just cook up these onions and red peppers. I'm thinking I might put more red onions in there. I'm not sure yet, but now this is what I do. I just saute these up. Saute. I cannot talk. Saute these up until they're done. Then we'll put the pineapple in the sauce. The rice is almost probably done. The rice is probably done. 
So I'm going to sauce these, cook these up. It's a whole green pepper and um, some red onions. I'm not, but I use onions really fast, so I don't have to use the whole onion in the recipe. But I won't use um, peppers up quickly, so I just used up all the peppers. I think I have enough onions. It's like a half of a small red onion. And just get these all sauteed up. And I will come back with you to put the pineapple in the sauce. Then I will show you how it all looks at the end. Thank you for watching us again. Good night. See you in a little bit with this almost finished product. Bye. Hi guys, um, I put the pineapple in with the onions and the peppers, and now it's time for the sauce. I'm going to put you down real quick so I can scrape this out. Alright, so I made you guys look at the counter. I am back here with the sauce. And the rice is probably done. I cannot cook rice. Maybe because I need a lid on it. I don't know. But the chicken is in the um, microwave still. staying warm. And I'm just cooking this pineapple. And the vegetables with the sauce. I'm going to let this cook a little bit longer. Then I will be back to show you how I assemble my sweet and sour chicken. Um, hopefully I can do that with one hand. So, I don't know. I might just show you on the plate. Um, yeah. Alright, we'll see you in a jiffy. Hi everybody, it's me. It's all done. I'm sitting on my couch watching some TV. I how about what I do? You can't see it really now. Woo! Is I put the rice at the bottom. It's really soupy. Then I put the chicken on. Then I put the vegetables with the sauce, and I topped it with some sesame seeds because I have a thing for sesame seeds. So yeah. Um, I'm gonna let you guys go, and I will put you. Won't, I even though I said yesterday, my. The last haul won't be posted up until the following day, but this video will be posted up tomorrow, um, so yeah. Um, just to let you guys go, this is what it looks like. It's kind of soupy, but there's some rice at the bottom. So, alright, well, sweet and sour chicken for day four of October. See you later, bye.